for such institute, you can image that they are doing something. I mean, in the biosafety four level labs, you are doing some pathogen like Ebola, smallpox, or plague. And besides, you also can do some gain the function experiment for some unknown pathogens. You won't let this kind of biosafety issue come out because the leaders are not stupid. They know how dangerous this is. So they take the very, very strict surveillance for that. This kind of leak, a leakage accident things are just the things Chinese government want you to believe. And for the other part of this question, I think uh, he wanted to mention that there may be an accident from this kind of gain the function labs. But I work in the P3 lab in the WHO reference lab for several years. Let me explain to you how strict this kind of uh, management for this kind of P3 and the P3 plus lab and even the P4 lab. So basically I can tell you after the very strict training and under the 24 hour surveillance, people come into those P3 lab or above level lab. They are the only ones can come back alive. I mean, it's no animal, no other pathogens get into that lab can leave the lab alive. All the animals, all the pathogens, if they want to leave this P3 or above lab, they have to go through as a very strict inactive procedure to make it already lose the activity or go through the uh, autoclave. That procedure means very high temperature, very professional uh, procedure to get it uh, hot enough to kill all this kind of passage from those garbage, dead body, all these things. So basically, if you want to believe the accident, then I can tell you that it's just the alternative choice the China CCP government want you to believe. I can tell you before 19th January this year, before I reviewed this virus, it's come from PLA lab uh, based on Joshan bat virus through Luda's media. Our government always try to let people believe that it's a natural origin the uh, virus come from Huanan seafood market. But the next day, when they realize that I already reviewed this message and deliver it out, they make some kind of alternative choice that based on this kind of natural origin theory, they also have the backup plan that when people try to uh, find out it is not from nature, they can see this is just accidental release from the lab. So that's why later they put uh, uh, some law to say that to uh, enhance the biosafety issues in the Chinese labs. And also they quickly send the bioweapon general uh, proof Wei Chen to Wuhan Institute and to uh, try to clean all this evidence take over for whole institute.